Hi, this is Mike, and today I'm going to show you how to go ahead and make sure the uh, double opt-in is turned off to get response. Um, sometimes you want to have double opt-in on. That's where you actually have that whenever someone gets onto your capture page and puts in their email information, they get an email back that they actually have to confirm by clicking the link before they get added to your list. Now, if you have a really good lead magnet, that's a great way of making sure you have good emails. Well, sometimes you don't want to do that. You Sometimes you're paying on the traffic you're buying or subscribing to, you want to make sure you get every single lead email possible. In that case, you want to turn the double opt-in off. So in order to do that, okay, I go, I'm actually on the dashboard, and from the dashboard, I select the campaign that I want to use. Okay, I've already selected it here. It's Brandon Mike, but I want to show you here. This is how you select it. And you click on the gear. Okay, from here, go ahead and click on permissions, and just make sure these are all unchecked. It really is that easy. Okay, so once these are all unchecked, then you know you're ready to go, and you turn the double opt-in off. Okay, thank you very much. And if you want to have more email tips like this, make sure you check out our blog at brandonmike.com. That's B-R-E-N-A-N-D-M-I-K-E.com. Okay, thank you very much. Bye-bye.